Hello art lovers, welcome back to another art video. I am Japneet and you are watching Fight Paper Cards. So today we are going to paint a beautiful spiral galaxy and we will be using acrylic paints. So before we begin with today's painting, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also hit the notification bell. To start with, I have Persian blue and black in my palette and I'll be covering my canvas with the mixture of black and Persian blue. And I'll let this space dry and afterwards I'll start painting over it. I'll be starting with titanium white from the center and I'll be creating some guidelines first. And we'll be creating a spiral and you can see here I am starting from the center and moving outwards. And I'm using my round brush over here to create the guidelines. And I am starting with cadmium yellow and mixing Persian blue with it to get this beautiful green color and I've also mixed titanium white to get that lighter tone and let me tell you that from the center I'll be using titanium white and as I move outwards the color will become darker and to be specific it will be dark blue color and you can see in my palette I have blue color Persian blue and I have mixed titanium white with it so basically I am using only three colors cadmium yellow Persian blue and titanium white And also black to get a darker tone. So my this painting is inspired from my dream of stars. And to understand all the effects of galaxies, I have taken a reference photo over here. And if you are a beginner, I recommend using a reference photo to understand all the effects of galaxies especially the gases that are present in the galaxy and after practicing you will be able to get the desired results so before painting on canvas i have tried a lot on my sheet first and when i was confident enough then i started painting on canvas and here you can see that our spiral moves outward with the light blue color and you can see I am just using my brown brush over here to place my color over it and don't worry about uh, the lines the perfection of the lines because we don't want the perfect lines over here as we are going to use a sponge pop to create some beautiful gassy effect so at this point I'm just placing my color over the guidelines that I've created so when we are creating something from a reference you don't need to depend totally upon your reference you can make changes according to your choice like for this painting if I'm using a reference photo I'm not completely using the same colors that have been used in the reference but 
I have changed the colors according to my choice. You can also become creative in your process of painting because painting is something that comes straight from your heart and it should be that way. So we'll be working in layers over here. For the first layer I'm creating some stars and I'm using a toothbrush over here, an old toothbrush to spray some white paint over it and you can see some white spots that, that will depict stars. And you can use any uh, other technique that you know to create stars but don't use patterns because we want tiny stars over here. So you can see I have white paint in the middle. So now you can see here I have started using my sponge. You, and I'll be using a lighter color and I'm just dragging my paint outwards. I'm pressing my sponge and moving outwards and, and I'm creating a arc like motion. And I'm using a lighter color over the first layer. So using the same technique, we'll be creating this on all the guidelines and you can see here we have got this beautiful gassy effect on all the guidelines. I'm still using my sponge. But as we move outwards, we have to take a darker color. So now you can see we are creating a second layer and we are repeating the same process of creating stars. You will notice that the stars that you had created in the first layer have become dim. So this is the effect of galaxy that not all stars are visible some are dim some twinkle so here I'm creating stars of red color the stars have different colors so here I'm creating red colored stars for this, I have Crimson Lake over here. To get a blurry look of the stars, just place a spot of white color and smudge it with your hand or with your sponge. You will get that blurry effect. Also remember that uh, don't try to create all the effects at once. Let the first layer dry completely and then you can move over it with the second layer then you will be able to get the desired results. And if you go over a wet area you will pick up some wet paint and you will not be able to get your desired effect. So as you can see I am repeating the process again and again but I am also letting the paint dry completely and then I move over it to get the other layer.
so from here on i'll let you enjoy the process and i'll come back when it's done So we are almost done with our painting. Just creating some more stars over it. So here we have our painting of the day, our spiral galaxy in acrylic paint. I hope you like this painting if you did hit the like button and also let me know your views and opinions about this painting in the comments below and i'll get back to you next time with something new and interesting till then keep painting